So if you've watched my previous video about the Johnson Company and their suppressor covers, you know that uh, I really like their products. And uh, the quality and craftsmanship is uh, second to none, if you ask me. But anyways, I, I have a VR-80 shotgun, and the hand grip gets really hot because of the piston-driven uh, system. And uh, I was talking to Red, and uh, he mentioned that he does hand guard heat wraps as well. So I went ahead and uh, bought one. And uh, this is what we're looking at. I went ahead and got it in cryptic camo. But uh, we're going to install this on the VR-80. And uh, see how it is. It's even got a... Unlike a suppressor cover, it's got a smooth, well, not a smooth, but it's got a textured uh, hand grip area, which is pretty cool. So the package says, features hand positioning reference point, soft point of contact, reduces heat mirage from the rail and barrel, and eliminates the need for gloves. For a VR-80 semi-auto 12-gauge shotgun, if, you, if you're not aware, this is a definite need once you crank up some some rounds on it. So I'm looking forward to throwing this on the shotgun and uh, seeing how it works. So stay tuned for that. So this is what happened with the gas piston on the VR80 when I put just the wrap on it. I tested it out with this cover. Um, I didn't put the the actual cryptic on it but I just wanted to test it and, and my assumptions were correct the the amount of gas coming out of that piston kind of like a revolver cylinder you really don't want your hands that close to it so that's when I thought about putting the kydex inside and kydex kydex from the oven okay. What it does. All right. It's almost looks like it's too long. Right? Right. Now luckily, Red asks you for the diameter of the handguard when he makes these covers. And he does allow a little wiggle room, which is nice because I wasn't expecting to have to add this kydex. So, we're going to go like that.
good to go. Whew. Now I got some cleaning up to do. <laughs> so I'm going to call this a success. Now if a person wanted to, they could buy the extended rails and I think they have less holes in there. But to me, this is kind of the, the easiest route to go.